morning, guys. We are, we just put fuel in the pickup. Now we're headed down to load up the sheep that we're taking over to Skip's. Um, and then I've got another couple head and their lambs that are going to come up here to the house. But I have a little bit of fence to fix that I still haven't gotten to. The trees that are above that fence, we had a limb fall onto the fence. So we need to pull that out and put another T-post up to keep that piece of fencing standing. And then after that, I have no idea what today is all about. Um, if I had my choice, we would be tearing down the barn to get ready for clean out. But I'm guessing we're going to go put out more signs, which is what we did all day yesterday as well. Because that seems to be all we do these weekends. But it's, it's, we are just over a month from election. So we're getting, we're getting closer to the end. This week is going to be busy for me because I have to clean out the barn. I have to finish his signs. I have to bring in the ewes that are going to lamb once the barn is put back together. And that's about all I have time for this week. I'm thinking I should have brought more sheep. There is a ton of grass out here, a ton brought eight ewes in their lambs, like 10 lambs. Now granted, I can bring more eventually. Um, yeah, oversight on my part. We're going to walk the fence line and fix any holes that we may find. The good thing is nothing got out of this side last year. So I can't imagine that there's going to be a whole lot to fix. But um, better safe than sorry. Well, every year it gets a little bit easier to. Um, <laughs> he's put. He's dealing with his sign. Um, gets a little bit easier to to fix the fence because there is thankfully not a lot. I think we found two little holes. Um, I'm guessing the dogs came through them. So. Yeah, I think we're gonna let the sheep out and they only need to hold the moms for a month. Then it'll be weaning about the 15th of May. I think I'll wean these guys and then we'll bring over a bunch more lambs. Not a bunch, but there's 10 lambs. So I think we'll bring probably 20, 25 total. So 15 more. That's the plan anyway. We'll, we'll see what reality brings. Sure. Come on, girls. Come on, babies. Come on. Come on. I wish he hadn't been a single. I really like him. All right, sheep are moved to skips. Lunch has been ate. We've walked this front pasture. I need to bring a panel for one section where there's like a probably six inch gap between the ground and the gate. And I just would rather them not get out. You know, those little things. So I need to bring a panel up, but we're gonna go ahead and grab those other ewes in the barn and their lambs and bring them up here. And the thistles are going insane. 
I've got to get some spraying done. I'm, uh, I just don't have enough hours in the day. I guess sleep is overrated. It's summer, right? So we are going to get those sheep, bring them up. Uh, he might try and see if we can get the four-wheeler started. Maybe put the spray tank on the back. Or we're going to go put up more signs. I, I don't know at this point. I just know the sheep up to the house is the next step. And then we will figure out after that. Tomorrow will be a tear down the barn. Work on more signs. That might be all I have time for tomorrow. It's a long ways away. We'll see what happens. Come on, girls. Come on. Come on. You too, little boy. Come on. Come on. Come on, Probably not going to happen as smooth as it did last time. Come on, Whitney. Is that hers? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I know. I said I wasn't going to keep him. But you did. Well, maybe he'll go to the guy that wanted a boy. Because okay. I, I really like him. He's an ace baby and he's a twin. Hey, Ma. Come on, Ma. No, no, no. Hey. Come on, girls. Come on. Yeah, I'm hoping better feed. Like I said, her brother's, he's doing awesome. So I don't know if she just quit feeding her or if she's got something else going on. But, yep, yeah, this will keep them for the next month easy. Oh, yeah. Especially if it's supposed to snow again this week. A little squishy. Squishy. Oh, and now the wind changed. Totally other direction. That's that. <laughs>
does better when that breeze just picks up a little bit. Yeah, the sacrifices we make. Well, it's definitely been one of those been busy all day but getting nothing done so we hauled sheep to skip we hauled sheep up to the house we burned the tulies he's hauling hay um yeah it's 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 been a lot of all-day projects that we just haven't got very far on so the good thing is this next coming week should be fairly easy. The, uh, I only have two, two pens to feed. Patty really loves her rams. So we will have the rams, we'll feed them, and then we've got these guys to feed. That's it. That's all I have to feed right now. And as soon as the water gets turned on, for the canal system, which is what waters the ram pasture. I can throw the rams out there and then I won't have to feed them either. They will be out on pasture and I won't have to worry about them. It will make my life fairly simple, except that I start breeding, no, sorry. I start lambing a week from today. So I have this week to get the barn, cleaned out and then bring the sheep in so that that is really my big focus this week besides getting a few more of his signs painted and I had to laugh somebody commented on my video today about how I say I'm doing everything and I'm staying busy but I don't show you anything that I'm doing Do you guys really want to sit and watch me paint for 10 hours a day you cannot be that bored <laughs> <laughs> you do not want to see me paint 10 hours a day, which is what I've been doing. So we will have plenty of stuff going on this week. And then next week we start lambing. So I don't know what else I'll be doing besides lambing. Hopefully disking and um, spraying weeds, but it's farming. Everything's kind of up in the air until it actually happens. All right, I'm gonna get these guys fed and then we will, I think we're gonna go put out more signs. 
yay. So he wants to scrape this alley tonight and I don't think he can. This is why we didn't scrape it last time because he was hitting these bunks. We need to move them for him to get through here, but he wants to try, so. I think I need to pull these off um, where we're missing the boards so that he can get through there. I just can't remember. I'm hoping someday we will have time to actually put the boards back on where they belong. They're sitting in a pile way down there. So I just need the time. I think he is on his last load out, at least for the alleyway, but that's just one step further. Uh, tomorrow I will take down all the jugs, all the gates, all the panels. I will gut the entire inside. And I forgot to ask him if he has a meeting tomorrow night or not. I don't think I have meetings this week. God, I hope I don't have any meetings this week. Um, but we will, we will get the rest of the barn done in the next couple days, hopefully, as long as he doesn't have anything going on, just moving along as best we can. So we will see you guys tomorrow.